Earthlings, welcome to 7th Street, and welcome back to 7th Street Productions' 31 Days of Halloween, where we are right smack dab in the middle of counting down my personal favorite 31 horror films of all time. And uh, we finally reached an anthology horror film. That's always good news, because anyone who watches my channel should know that I am a huge fan of horror anthology movies. And this is the granddaddy of them all, directed by George A. Romero, my favorite director, and written by arguably one of the best authors uh, in modern history, Stephen King. Um, arguably. <laughs> I can see you disag maybe disagreeing with me back there. But, um, uh, anyhow, Creepshow is obviously a, uh, horror anthology that's inspired by, like, uh, EC Comics from back in the 50s, you know, just those sort of, like, um, you know, comeuppance, uh, morality tales. Uh, so many of these are good. Uh, there's obviously the short about, um, the, the Father's Day cake, the father who comes back to life to get his Father's Day cake. Uh, there is, uh, the couple that gets buried on the beach and returns as zombies. Sorry, I'm trying to remember all these. There's the crate, the monkey in the crate, which is my personal favorite. Um, there is the one that, uh, uh, Stephen King stars in about the meteor that crash lands with all the weird plants that grow all over everything. And then finally, uh, the, the segment they're creeping up on you about the, the old racist guy who lives in sort of this, like, like pristine, uh, germ-free house, this, like, apartment in New York City, and all these roaches start coming up through the drains and everything, and they ended up, uh, they end up eating him alive. Spoiler alert. Um, gosh, it, this is just, uh, a movie that is, uh, I'm so, like, nostalgic over as well. I saw it at a really young age. Uh, I can still remember my dad telling me about this movie, because uh, I started getting into horror films, and I remember him mostly talking about uh, the cockroach one, and him even telling me, oh, and at the end of it, there's this shot that looks down with all these cockroaches all over him, like, coming out of his mouth, and it just, like, I don't know, I just got so excited to see that movie, uh, but my parents would never let me rent it. My dad would, like, tell me these stories, kind of as, like, ghost stories at night, um, and then finally it played on TV, and that was the first place that I saw it. That was probably the first two times I saw it was uncut, or, uh, to uh totally television cut on TV. Um, and then a few years later I obviously got the VHS tape, and then a DVD. I do need to get it on Blu-ray, but this is just a fantastic movie. It's so, it, it, I mean, it's just a classic. Uh, this is, I would obviously say, a must-watch it's George Romero and Stephen King. It's an anthology movie that's, like, in the style of a comic book. Everybody's in it. Adrian Barbeau. Um, everybody, everybody's in this fucking movie. So, uh, definitely check it out. This is a must-watch. Creep show. <laughs> <laughs> 